becomes a new word. Act, action, isn't it? Here I added full. Here I added any men. Here I added I go in. So all these added words are called as suffixes. Where are we adding it? After the main word or the root word of the base word. Let us see one more word. Good. So, what shall we add? G O O D. Good. L E S S. So, what did we add here? L E S S. It becomes goodness, isn't it? It becomes goodness. Suppose if I write dry. Now, D R Y N E S S. Dryness. So, the word entirely changes. Okay, the entirely the word changes. So one more thing, children. These suffixes you can add to adverbs, nouns, and as well as to adjectives. Where where can you add adverbs, adjectives, and nouns? For all these words, you can add suffixes. Let us see one example of adverb. Okay, adverb. So this is an example for adverb. So we added l y l. Okay. Now one more we will add to nouns. What is that nouns? Spoon. Spoon is the base word. Now I will write s p o o n f u n. So you added full here. So this is suffix. Okay, this is suffix. This is for adverb. This is noun. And now let us see the adjective. Okay, let us see the adjective. G R E E N. Green. This is the base word. And for this green, I will add G R E E N I S H. N I S H. Greenish. Okay, so you added here I S H. So green is an adjective. So when and then you can add suffix to adverbs, nouns, and for adjectives also. So the this part is called as suffix. Hope it is clear. Suffix. So suffix we add after the base word of the root word so this is about suffix now let us study prefix yes just opposite to the suffix is prefix for suffix you are after adding after the base word for prefix you will add before the base word yes that is the major difference only that is the major difference prefix prefix what is this prefix let us write the definition it is a word or group of letters added added before added before a base or root word base or a root word that give rise to another new word that gives another new word that gives another new word w o r d word so this is the definition of the prefix it is a word added before a base or root word and that gives another new word and that gives and that will give rise to another new word example i will write the example you can understand it better so example here i have work so this work 
we can call it as base word. Okay. This is the base word. This word is base word. And to this base word, if I add a group of letters or a word before this, here I write over. Now it becomes what? Overwork. So this over is called as prefix. What do we call it as? Prefix. Over one. Got it? Yes. It was exactly the opposite in case of suffix. But here you add the prefix before the base word. Let us see one more example. Call. C-A-L-L. This call is a base word or a root word. I will add here. R E. So this re becomes prefix. Okay? This re becomes prefix. So now the word is completely changed. What do we say? Call is something calling. Recall is something which you dig from your past. Isn't it? Recalling which you have already known and you are trying to recall that. Yes. So recall. The word is completely change so what is sometimes children with this prefixes just by adding a prefix we can also make the opposite words i will show you the example see here you have happy isn't it happy is a base word if i add un this un becomes the prefix this becomes prefix and this happy is a base word or a root word. So for happy, when you add un, it becomes unhappy. So the happy's opposite word is unhappy. So like this, even by adding sometimes prefixes, you can even write the opposite words. One more example I will write here. Honest. Okay. H-O-N-E-S-T Honest is the base word. For this honest, if you add dishonest, it becomes this. If you add this prefix, it becomes dishonest. So honest is being sincere, being faithful. But when you add the prefix this, it becomes dishonest. The opposite of honest who is not sincere, who is not Faithful. So like this, sometimes even we can change the word and sometimes even by adding prefer, uh, prefix, even we can write the opposite words also. So we have many prefixes like regular, ill, ir we are adding, impatient, impatient. Like this, we have many prefixes. So hope the concept is clear to you. Prefix and suffix and the homework to you is you have to list 10 prefixes and 10 suffixes in your notebook that is in your homework book you have to write 10 different suffixes and 10 different prefixes in your homework book so apart from that in the last class fourth standard children i taught you homophones isn't it same sound Different spelling and different meaning are called as homophones. So, these are some pictures you can write the spellings. Bark, bark. So, bark of the tree, the sound made by the dog is also called as bark. So, here you have rule, rule or ruler, ruler. The ruler of king is also called as the ruler and the scale which you use to draw the line is also called as ruler. Like this, based on the pictures, you can complete these homophones and as well as you have to complete this which man suffixes on page number 39. On page number 39, you have to complete this suffixes. Okay? On page number 39, you have to complete this 
suffixes as well as on page number 40 also we have some suffixes got it so complete this means in your textbook got it children even third standard children have to prepare or make a list of 10 different suffix words and 10 different prefix words in your homework book Oh, okay, uh, I hope it is clear to you. I will see you in the next class. Thank you children.